How do you do? This is Mayor Hawthorne, and you're watching Change Up TV. A little change look good on you. Shabow. How are you doing? I am so extremely wonderful. I'm having the greatest day of my life. Good. Well, welcome to Baltimore. Thank you. So being signed to an indie label, do you find yourself being budget conscious at all? If you're trying to make a lot of money at your job, don't, don't be a musician. <laughs> <laughs> I love being an independent artist. You know, you, you have more freedom than, than anybody else, but um, it's a challenge sometimes. You know, you gotta, you gotta make ends meet when, when they don't meet. Well, I mean, obviously it's working for you. You've been um, getting a lot of recognition in the mainstream, uh, Prez Hilton, and most recently Jimmy Kimmel Live. Tell me about that. It's always a trip, you know, just for something that I, I never expected would be, you know, getting this kind of attention. Thing. So what's in your future? I am going to be touring like a maniac through the rest of 2010, doing a lot of festivals. I've got, um... We've got a remix coming out on Snoop Dogg's More Malice, which drops March 23rd. It's amazing. Um, yeah, that was that was fun working with working with Uncle Snoop. <laughs> Tell me about that. Uh, he's he's the greatest. He's a he's an old soul head, so we get along really well. You know, he listens to nothing but you know the dramatics and uh, the moments and the shy lights. It's, it's like you know it was, it was a blast working with him. He's 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 really like my uncle now. It's, it's dope. That's amazing. So hip hop is known for using samples, but you use real instruments on your album. Tell me about that. Yeah, I did. There, there are no samples on my album, and that's something I'm extremely proud of. You know, I, I played the majority of the instruments on the album myself. That's like, you know, really, that's part of the fun for me. And the, I, I enjoy the challenge of, you know, pushing myself and and saying, you know, I. I can I can play that part, you know. Let me let me let me do it myself. When and how did you get started playing music? I got started at a very early age. Uh, my father plays bass guitar. He still plays bass in a band in Michigan to this day, and uh, he taught me to play bass when I was about six years old. I've been a hip hop DJ and producer for the past ten plus years, and um, it was it was not until I met Peanut Butter Wolf of Stones Throw Records that. I was convinced to uh, record an album of soul music. I've been extremely fortunate that the majority of the celebrities are, are high profile people that have spoken out about my music. I have a, a great deal of respect for as well, so. Well, you definitely have a very unique style. What advice could you give to upcoming artists? Do your homework. That's my advice to, to upcoming artists, is, is do your homework and know you know, do your research and, and know what has come before you. Be, be original, be different, you know, I mean, you hear it a million times, but it's, it's tough. It's tough to come up with something original and new, but you, you, have, to, you have to find your own, your own sound. That's, that's the most important thing. Well, thank you so much for being here today. I am Jamie with ChangeUpMag.com, and this is Mayor Hawthorne.